Okay, so back. Now, where do we go from here? Okay, we've got a bunch of believers, and we've got a bunch that have a bunch of fake news and what have you that are really totally confused right now, and uh, probably uh, giving our crew a little bit of a hassle. Well, here's the best thing about fake news, is, uh, you know, when you go back and you tell them the real truth, uh, you don't have to worry about changing your stories anymore. And so, clearing up the fake stories and, and putting the truth out there, that's a, a really good start. Because, you know, we were hiding as a group before Christmas, and we were doing it on purpose. And it was uh, really fun, but uh, it was that way for a reason, because uh, we, gave, we got a, a group core, a good news crew, and all of you that uh, were on uh, in all this, yeah, you guys, you guys rock, and you got it all, you know, but now we need to take those others that were kept in the dark, because see, we had to see the vision of what God wanted the world to be. The only way we could do that is the way that we led up to. We had to believe that uh, he was going to snap his fingers and everybody was going to be gone that was bad. Well, now that it hasn't happened, we can also tell the story of why it was what it was. And we'll be able to clear this up. Because in reality, it was supposed to us to see the dream of what God wanted. And we did, didn't we? Yes, we did. We've seen it full fledged, and this is what we want. And I totally love that package. I, I think we need to do that. And so, yeah, damage control on those that uh, were out of the loop. That's going to be a key number one thing on this. We're going to have to clear up those stories and say, you know what? We were doing it on purpose. And uh, God had his reasons. He wanted us to see the full potential of what we could be. But uh, he couldn't do that without having a solid inside core group. And that's why it was the way it was. But now it's open to everybody. And we got to get it open to everybody. We got to get everyone to know that we're changing the world. Yes. New world package is coming. We just don't know when. That's that's the gig. Because we're way over majority now in the world. And uh, we uh, it's hard to understand because you don't see the numbers. Well, that's the next step. we got to start getting some numbers together. Some real numbers. And real organizations in every village. We need to know who is and who isn't aware of avatar theory and if you're in a village and you don't have any group that's getting it together then that probably be someone like you just get it started and and then you can find out from them and they and then they can find out from you and then they're like oh yeah i got a list over here and i got a list before you know it you got figured out who's in the, and who's not on your village and then uh then we have to start working on the ones that aren't and uh, we got to start organizing in each village to Make a party for them to come over to see. Make them to understand what it was all about that Christmas Eve that uh, we seen the dream. We seen the vision of God's plan for the mankind, the future, the new world. We're going to have to uh, make the efforts to straighten up these stories that we created to make this vision possible. And help them to understand why that had to be the way it was. So in organizing, though, we'll get every village up to speed and the world will start to uh, heal itself. Because in reality, if everyone thinks about it, if they know they're being watched and they know they're doing the, that God is going to be with them in every moment they are, they start acting better and they start acting right. And that's the general direction we're going for, isn't it? Yeah, we want everyone to start acting like they have consequences in every action they do. Because they do, damn it. That's it. It, it is. That's the way it is. So, 
bringing them up to speed and bringing them up uh, in an organization of uh, knowing their numbers and knowing who, where we stand, that's a good thing. That's something we need to develop. And that way we know where we stand. Uh, you know, as we come to this March 17th date, um, we'll have to have the strong numbers. And we have to have the strong numbers all around the world if we can. That's that's the gig. Although I have a feeling uh, there'll be a couple that might still stick out. But uh, we might be able to just go on without them and uh, make this new world thing ourselves and uh, be okay. And they can jump on when uh, they decide they want to ride the train. <laughs> if they don't, they can just stand on the sidelines and watch it go by. It's okay. We, we're, we're not going to get upset about somebody who doesn't want to ride the train. We want to ride the train of freedom. We want to ride the train of a new world. We want to live with the world being fair and equal to everybody and everybody being taken care of. So, yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's what we need to get spread around. And that's what everybody needs to, because I can't get it to everybody. You can. You can. You can do your part. And you can help spread this avatar theory. Make it big. Make it bold. Make it, uh, guys, you got to see this. You got to see your, your eternal soul circling counting on this, dude. Now shut up and listen, okay? So uh, anyway, that's what he wants me to tell you guys. Let's, let's organize. And let's organize out in the open now. That's the key. We're going to organize in the open. We're not going to be hidden in closets and secret codes and, and words. No, that's done. That part's over. Now the part is coming out into the world and letting them realize that their internal soul is literally on the line. Probably want to pay attention. Probably want to pay attention, okay? And let me tell you how this goes, all right? Anyway, I'll be back. <laughs>